my main man, Finesse Mitchell, co-hosting with us today. Give it up for Finesse, y'all, all right? Bless, bless, yes. And since he's here, you know we had to help, you know, have him help us out with the real fam and our relationship questions, so it's time to say it with me, audience. Manslation! I love manslation! It's my favorite subject. You love it? It's my favorite segment. I love All right, good. All right, let's get started. Adrian, Amanda, and Tamara are in the audience with our first question from Angela and Randall. Okay, hey, you two. How are you? Hey, hey. So, where are you guys from? We're from Rancho Cucamonga. Nice. Okay. And what is your situation? My question is, I need to know how to get better gifts. I asked for a bouquet, and he gives me a single rose. <laughs> Randall. No. Wait, maybe Randall, Randall has a good Randall. reason. Randall. What is your take on this? I do. I was coming home late. It was Valentine's Day, and I left my debit card at home, so... You know, I just used what I had on me, which was cash, and I got the best gift that I could get. Okay. Okay, well, Finesse, what do you think is going on between Angela and Randell? <laughs> Unacceptable, Randell. <laughs> Unacceptable. She said three years? Mm -hmm. Three years. Let me tell you something about relationships, people. Everything new gets old, but everything that's true stays new. She gave you a layup, a layup, and, and you messed that up. Three years is a very pivotal point in a relationship because it's like, ooh, are we going to stay together or are we going to walk? But, man, it is so up to you to keep making her feel like that queen that she is. And so I would have rather said, babe, I got something so big planned for you that I didn't want to mess it up because I just left my... I would have came with the truth versus... If she just said, bring flowers, and you come in with one rose? And I question that, because you can only get them in the club and the gas station. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? So... You didn't plan ahead. What I was about to say, you should have planned it ahead. It was Valentine's Day. You knew it was Valentine's Day. Like. You should have just said, I got something so big planned, but I actually left my wallet at home, because that means you waited to the last minute. So you was just wrong all the way around so just the situation. tell the truth. That's just what tell the said. truth in that situation. All right. all right. We hope that helped y'all, okay? <laughs> Do better. Right. 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 Okay. Our next question comes from Brianna, who is calling in with her question. Hey, Brianna. How are you, girl? Hey, I'm so good. How are you, Lonnie? I am fine. What's your question? And where are you from first? Where are you from? I I am from Louisville, Kentucky. All right, we yes. live in Louisville. All right. Yes, my home. And my question, my current situation, my ex-boyfriend recently reached out to me, pretty much just expressing how much he still loves me and cares for me. And he was very apologetic about all the mistakes that he's made in the past. Mind you, this is my college boyfriend from years ago. Here's the kicker. He is currently in a relationship. 